Hey there, folks. It's 1232, 1233, Wednesday, June 9th, 2021. As uh, many of you already know, uh, many of you that are getting the consultations, the DNA, the last DNA ICUCs, these are uh, handy wipes, uh, they're moistened. I want to show you something. Deanna wants to make sure that no one ever says you're misrepresenting something to her. And honestly, if anyone says that, well, they're wrong because of the way she is. Now, here's a piece of sodalite that, that we sell. I just recently bought just a little bit of it. Now, see what it looks like now. You take a wet wipe. And yet, it's cleaning the dust off, but also water is considered like the poor man's polish. It helps you look at a stone and see what it is, but without polishing it, uh, it'll fade away. Now you look at it, it's different. Here's another piece. Okay. So... The stones, when you see the pictures of them, or even in video, I don't go to the time to uh, clean all of them up. Uh, I should. It's just, there's so much going on, so much to do, and I'm still deleting stuff on the other side, putting some of the stuff to sleep, uh, dealing with folks that have issues. Uh, and when I say folks, I mean I'm out of body. All right, you remember what that looked like a minute ago. There it is now. As it dries, it gets a little drier. There's others that are even more blue than this. I mean, it's just incredible. Now, here's a nice piece of the kunzite, this pink kunzite that we've gotten. Some is a little more purple. It's pink purple kunzite. Some of it's a little clear, but... Take it, you see it now. This towel is starting to dry up. Now you look at it, it's a little different. It's a lighter side. Here's some more. The kunzite, that's uh, the thumbnail for the last video I put up before this. Um, it's just a piece of our kunzite that I cleaned. But like I said, it comes in slightly different colors. Now that affects the energy a little bit, but not a lot. It's still basically the same thing. Sometimes it's less clarity, more. Believe it or not, when you water a piece, we know who you are. We're going to send you the piece that's right for you. If you specifically ask for something and we have it, then it's fine. It's not a problem. It's just like when we make the spheres for you. We know who you are. A personal sphere is what we know you need. And if you want, say, a pineal sphere, then we'll make a pineal sphere for you, but we're going to modify the stones in it so it fits you the best way possible. Okay, now look at it. Compare the before and after. So, it's beautiful stone, it really is. Now, like this piece and this thing that hasn't been wet or cleaned or anything, you're going to see these pieces and you're going to see a weight with it. I expect whoever Deanna wants to do it is how she's going to do it. And then there'll be a smaller piece. Uh, but anyway, uh, this small piece will weigh so much. This bigger piece, you know, weighs a whole lot more. I mean, look at it in size. It is, it's totally different. Then here's a, you know, a smaller but nice piece. <laughs> piece of highlight. Anyway, uh, So you remember what how big this thing looks. So 
uh, Dan and I are going <clears> to, <throat> I'm going to separate the stones and then Dan is going to set it up the way she wants. Uh, but we'll help you get the stone that, you know, you'll know it's like how much to pay for what stone. Deanna will take care of that. Um, starting this coming Monday, uh, starting the four, uh, the scheduling, we're going to start uh, for the 14th for the consultations. Um, their store will be open up uh, close to that. Now, I talked about a lot of these uh, stones that we had just gotten in. They're semi-tumbled. They're tumbled, so they're nice, but the actual texture is kind of soft. It's nice. This is a cleaned-off piece of some, not wet, but it's cleaned-off piece of iolite. This iolite that we have is awesome. Iolite, and this has been cleaned, and then it's dry, is grade triple a amethyst this is gem quality amethyst amethyst well as you hold it i don't know why i do the pinky thing as you hold it get the fingers out of the way that's why i do it as you hold the amethyst and relax it goes and it goes through your body, but especially in your brain, and it starts leveling out your brain waves a little bit. It's a lower frequency, so it helps you match with the field, which is there is no quote unquote Akashic records. However, there's information flowing freely through the field. And I was around before lives ever started. So the information I have is, is, is better than any you're ever going to find. But not just that. It's free. And it's complete. You're not being censored for what you can access and what you can't. If something's personal to someone else, it's not your business. But a basic idea of events with that person, that's, that's yours free to grab. So your personal stuff's not going out there as your as yourself, your spirit, sentient energy, no matter what body you were in. Highlight is the same way, but it's a little thicker. It's a little stronger. It has a little hit to your head. Uh, now we have uh, some grade uh, double A uh, amethyst. That's actually what they call chevron amethyst, but there's not a whole lot of chevrons in it. It's mostly just you know, it's mostly the amethyst part of it. Very high quality, very beautiful stuff. And then we have the um, crystalline, you know, the pure crystalline. You can kind of see through some of this stuff, and that's grade triple A. Um, the eye light works on the whole head. It actually works on you, but at the same time. It mellows out your frequencies to help you, you know, connect with uh, the source field. Uh, the source field is part of me. However, he has his own mind. When you take spirit from yourself and release it, it has its own mind. Other people have talked about soul retrieval. When you pull in that other part of your soul when it wants to and you bring it back into you, it's still separate inside you. It has its own mind but it's coming back to you to be with you. Um, also, don't forget about the, this quartz that we got our hands on. It's just beautiful, really clear. Uh, quartz and amethyst together are really nice. Quartz is, is like a neutral a neutral frequency it, it's almost like a sh as straight as a sheet of glass a lot of people say it's the highest frequency no there is none it's next to no frequency really it's it's a neutral frequency and then this is the selenite that we have it's nice hand carved tumbled uh tumbled excuse me uh po polished this stuff is awesome. This big, this piece is big enough for whatever you need. Uh, the plate selenite or slab selenite. Um, you've seen it. It's a flat sheet. You can 
see through most of it. The stuff that you can see through, if you look at it and you feel it, it's strong as hell. It's a matter of the clarity in it. Um, whatever kind of piece you want works, but if it's the slab selenite, it's strong. We have some big pieces like this. Uh, you look at the older videos I had, uh, there was big pieces of plate silicone in the back or slab or whatever you want to call it. Um, so anyway, um, okay, uh, to close this off here, um, consultations will be starting on uh, Monday the 14th that we're, con that we're scheduling them for. The store is going to be open <clears throat> probably just a few days right after that. Maybe there's enough time between now and then to where Deanna can open it up, uh, like maybe just a day or two late or something. Um, she'll let you know. It'll, it'll be on the website. Um, so, and oh, one last thing. This different citrine that we have, it's muddy, looks muddy, dark. It's dark citrine. I bought, when I, I bought this for a reason. And when I got it, I did not send it back because when I saw it and I reached out and felt it, I said, holy mackerel, that's strong. And then when I bought it, I felt it. That's powerful. That's the so strongest citrine I've ever seen or had in my hands ever. So, uh, and soda light's really good for the whole head too. Working on your whole head. Here's a, this is a huge piece of garnet, the biggest piece that we have that came in there. We'll be holding on to what the other ones are about, at the most, maybe two thirds his size, some maybe just a half. There'll be an idea. Uh, Deanna will give you an idea about uh, the um, size of the stone and the relative uh, price. It'll you know be a certain price within a certain weight range or something. Um, you'll see when you go to the website. Deanna is nothing but extremely fair about everything. The price of the stone, and hey, we crank it up. We crank it up with the strongest source there is anywhere. Me, Deanna is incredibly strong. She's from Lily and I. But see, after I go, there's other people doing crank ups. You know, you want one, get it wherever you want. It's up to you. You know, no one's saying, I've never said you have to go over here or over there. Um, I have said at one point that uh, people doing a crank up set a source up, and they can only do it if I've cranked them up. Um, otherwise, they're not strong enough. But uh, uh, the ones that are uh, uh, that have done it, I told them not to do it yet, uh, at the time. But that's because they were being attacked by other stuff and being messed with. And then when they go to do it, 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 it might work, it might not. So, you know, you have to be able to fight and beat up and, in my case, actually destroy any spirit that's messing with you. But once I'm out of here, that's that's all over. That'll never happen. The thing about Deanna is Deanna's 40% uh, of her energy is mine. Everything happens through the source field. Everything. <coughs> the source field goes through you. It goes through, you know, uh, nuclear reactors. It goes through everything. So that's why I talk about amethyst iolite um crystal uh, there's everyone has the frequencies that are selenite going through their body especially in the crown they come out along with citrine um but that's why i talk about those uh particular stones is because they really help the energy in your head. So does the uh, uh, the slab selenite. In my last video I called uh, the slab selenite silicone uh, two times back to back and then the next time I mentioned it I called it selenite which it is. That's just, you know, it. I meant to say selenite. It's just my conscious mind falling away. Okay, folks, uh, 
We'll have a list of those stones. The stones are really strong. Uh, you'll find the energy we talk about is actually there in it. Uh, the more you have the stone, the stronger you're going to feel. These spheres, um, uh, I had mentioned earlier in a previous video that when I crank people up, it feels different to me. That's because there's so much of me in the field. When I crank you up through myself out of body, it's actually actually cleaner. Blah. Having a hard time talking. So, and you're about to find out what I've been talking about all these years is not a bunch of crap. The one thing I've, the only thing I've said that really isn't panning out is, you know, when I was leaving and I can't help that. Anyway, folks, uh, Take care. Love you. See you soon. And uh, we'll have a lot of fun in the consoles. Um, it's always fun. I just, you know, I'm leaving, so I'm not as, you know, energetic and jovial as normal, but the energy is stronger and cleaner than it's ever been. Folks, take care. Love you. And See you soon.